Hello everybody, Dead Man's Macaroni here. Get your macaroni ready because this is part two of Chrono Trigger. Um, so in the last episode, we ended off fighting some blue imps. And getting a power bracelet. And we went through a strange portal. At least I think it was a portal. We'll load our game. Yes. Load complete. There we go. So what is this for market? Sure, we'll go to the market. Let's see who these guys are. So you've a mind to buy some weapons and join the fight against the Fiendlorn's Ark. Fiend Lord's army, have you? Wonderful. But remember to equip the weapons you buy. N not much meaning else wise. Well, alright. Let's see what he's got for sale. You didn't come all this way just to, to look, did you? Surely there's something you'd like to buy. Well, I hope so. Yeah, shelter. What do you have in terms of swords? Bronze blade? shooter. I can't afford either one. Bronze helm I already have. Padded vest, I could buy that. I really should buy the potion, but you know what? Armor's important too. There we go. My thanks. Do come again. I'll consider coming again. Who knows? Okay, Power Vest does 10 defense, I think. That's what it says. Alright. Now, what's this place? Residence. Let's go in here. See what this place is all about. I'm bound to the village blacksmith. I'm forging this bell at the king's behest as a symbol of his love for Queen Lynn. Lean. The Queen's vanishing act had me wondering if all this work would be off for naught. After all, what's the bell without the Queen, eh? But it seems they found her in the canyon up north. She's back at the castle now, and I'm back to work. Oh, that's good. Let's talk to this girl. My husband wants a daughter, both clever and fair. Hmm. Well, the castle's not even there. That's where... It... Jeez, we're just gonna drop the phone in every single part, aren't we? Sorry about that. And Butterfingers. I guess we have to go through the forests, then. Guardia Forest. Alright, let's go through it. Doesn't look like we got much of another choice. Ooh, the green imp. Ooh, cyclone, that's how you use that, I was wondering. Ooh, that hits all three of them. The green imp's a little bit more powerful than the blue one. Has a little bit more defense. Whoa, 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 man. You got two attacks. Unless this game isn't turn-based. Ooh, a potion. D-man's level increased. So do we have to, like, put a point into something, or does it just do it automatically? I'm gonna say it just does it automatically. Ooh, more enemies. Alright. Alright. Can I use Cyclone again? I can. Oh, it only hit one of them that time. That, that sucks. Taking some damage. Ah. Uh, may as well just attack. Ah, uh, well he's dead. 
Then we'll attack him before he can attack us. Aha! We're getting better. Another potion. Speaking of potions, I should probably use one. There we go. There we go. Health was getting a little bit low there, but... There's definitely a... Wait. The enemy dropped a shelter. What good's a shelter? Maybe that's how you save out here. Okay, I see the enemies. Oh no. Alright, let's hit these guys. Okay, that killed both of them. That's cool. They're running. Hit these guys. And they're both dead. Alright. Ten experience. We probably could go back there and buy that bronze sword soon. Which we definitely should do. Because this wooden sword's only going to get us so far. Can I search like these bushes? No, it's only certain ones. Oh well. It's alright, no big deal. Attack them. Oh, are they riding on those things? Oh, they are. I didn't realize that. Okay. Let's go cyclone. Oh, I can't. Well, that's just great. Oh, wait, am I poisoned or something? Nah, it doesn't look like it. Rondillo Rider. Oh, come on, attack him before you die, man. Now, can I use, uh... Potions when I'm in combat? Ooh, item. There we go. Getting a little bit nervous there. So we're pretty much dead if we didn't use that potion. Ooh, our level increased again. That's a good thing. Well, I'm enjoying the game so far. I think it's pretty cool. And here we are at the castle. So, halt. Who goes there? I've not seen your face before. And those outlandish clothes wouldn't be one of the Fiend Lord's agent agents, would, would we? Ah, fat chance. Look at him. The boy's not built to lift a sword, let alone serve the Fiend Lord's army. Ugh, suppose you're right. Now run along, boy, before we're first forced to lock you up in the towers. Stop that at once. Queen Ling. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right, but... That man is my friend, and you will treat him as such. But your majesty, there's something strange about his look. Oh, it's her. You refuse to obey my orders? No, I... Forgive me, my lady. Please enter. <laughs> Alright. Looks like we just gained entry to the castle. But first... Let's see what's over here. Nothing. Fantastic. Alright, well... Head on in, then. See what this place is all about. What does this guy got to say? Hmm. Well, fine, then, man. I am to understand that you played some role in helping rescue my lady wife. I owe you a debt of gratitude. Might you know what befell Lean? She has been acting rather oddly since her return. She seems to have lost the coral hairpin she always wore. She... Always treasured that thing, so... Forgive me. You must be tired. Please rest in the knight's quarters down the stairs to the left. I'll speak to the commander. Hmm. The king's chambers are atop the tower ahead. The knight's quarters are downstairs. Go straight from here and you'll find the stairway to the left. Alright. 
They told us to go downstairs, but you know what? Well, actually, let's just do what they say. Um, so downstairs... Do they mean that we're supposed to go... This way? Maybe? Looks like it. Looks like it. Alright. What's this guy have to say? The dining hall is for members of the knighthood, but you're welcome at our tables. Eat your fill before you go. Nice, nice. What is this guy doing? I, I'm dying. I'm dying of hunger. There's food right there, man. Your meal is ready. Finally! That's a huge friggin' meal, man. Can I, like, take his meal? That'd be awesome if I could take it. No, I can't. No. Nice. The master of the kitchen is earned his post. His cooking is worthy of at least three stars. Hmm. The Fiendlorn's troops have a better watch out for us. Yeah. Can we talk to her? Hungry, my lord, take a seat at the upper left corner of the left table. Alright. The upper left corner of the left table. Upper left corner of the left table. That's what I'm trying to do. It's not seeming to want to do it. Um, can we go? You know what? Forget this place then. Maybe there's something over here. I know we already went this way, but that was before I realized that there were stairs in these things. Okay, yeah, here we go. Nice quarters. That's the second time I've dropped the freaking phone in this episode. Why'd the music get so... Would you like to rest? Yes. Nice, nice. I'm actually going to save here, or not, you know, either way. Xanon Bridge is our last line of defense. It must hold, even should it mean our lives. You're the queen's friend, are you not? Talk to the maid if you need to rest. Uh, so did we have to do that? Well, regardless, I kind of needed it. I guess we have to go up this way then. Let's go find ourselves the queen. She's probably upstairs, like all the way upstairs. Her majesty awaits you. That's right, you better get out of my way. Looks like we're going the right way then. There she is. Oh no, it's been over ten years since Her Majesty first came to the castle, but she's scarce aged a day. In fact, she looks even younger now than she did before her disappearance. Yeah. I can explain that. Ah, there you are. Please leave us, I need to have words with this man in private. As you wish, your majesty. Excellent. Very excellent. Come near, don't be shy. Okay. <laughs> Fooled you, didn't I? D-man M. It's me, but everyone keeps calling me Lean for some reason. Or Len, or whatever. I'm glad you came. We were only 
together for that short time at the fair, but somehow I knew you'd come for me. Well, of course. Thank you, D-Man M. What's happening? I don't know. Don't ask me. Ah, crap. I feel, I feel like I'm being torn apart. Oh, no. Help me, D-Man M. I'm scared. It's like I'm dying. Please, D-Man M, help. It's such a dumb name. Ah, crap. Well, gee. Short as a reunion as that was. Suppose I should go tell the king. Her Majesty's dismissed you already? You didn't engage in any untoward behavior, did you? Of course not. Well, yeah. Of course not. Let us hope that is the case. Okay, they just say the same thing. We'll just say, of course not. Alright. Let's go warn the king, I guess. I don't know if there's anything in those rooms, but... To be honest, I couldn't care less. Be man in. Ah, oh, there she is. Whew, you're okay. Did you find the girl? I was wondering when she'd show up. She what? She disappeared? Hmm, it's just as I thought then. I knew I recognized her from somewhere. We seem to be in Guardia, but it looks a lot older than the Guardia we're from. Because it is! They must have mistaken that girl for her ancestor. After all, that girl was our Princess Nadia. Oh, well. I didn't know that. Tomorrow, that is, Princess Nadia is, is a descendant of Queen Lean. Hmm. What's going on here? Oh, Queen Lean was kidnapped and someone was supposed to have gone and saved her, but now history's been changed. Huh. Aw, oh, crap. So you're telling me that, that she was kidnapped, but since they found the other one, now no one's gonna go save her. Wow, oh, looks so much like the queen that they probably called off their search when she feared, but if the real queen is killed... Then they're all killed. Hmm. Marl will never have existed, but there might still be enough time. If we can save the queen, history as we know it should remain unchanged. Ah, well, let's hop to it then. Something must have happened to the queen if this, in this era if she isn't rescued, and if nothing, and if something happens to her, her descendant, Princess Nadia, will never come into being. We have to find the real queen. Well, as I said before, let's hop to it. Should I tell the king? Will he even listen? I am, am I to understand that you play some role in helping rescue my lady wife? I owe you the debt and gratitude. Oh. Might you know what befell me? She's been after. Yeah, we already read this. Okay. Let's just get out of here then. Before they suspect me of killing her. Or. Whatever happened to her. I think she just teleported somewhere. Okay. Well. Hang on a minute. Do we have enough? Enough, um. Gold? Yes, we do. Alright, let's go buy that bronze sword. Oh, here we go. So, are these set battles or something? That would make sense. Okay. Are you guys going to attack or not? Well, she has like a gun or something. That's kind of cool. We got two attacks there. Uh, let's just attack them. 
What does she have in terms of attack? Nothing. Oh, you can see their health. I didn't know that. Come on. Attack it. Alright, there we go. 120 gold. Jeez. That's a lot. Oh. More of these things? Alright. We may as well fight them. I'm assuming we're going to need to level up as much as we can. Alright. Did that take care of him? Yep, that did. Oh, she learned Flamethrower. Learned Fire World Dual Attack. Alright. I guess we'll have a chance to test that a little later. The enemy dropped a shelter. So can we just, like, constantly go there and grab that shelter or something? Hmm. Oh, I should have used, um... What is it called? Cyclone on them. Alright. Let's take him out. Oh, well, he's dead. Okay, well, at least at that point it just switches your attack target. Who do you think I'm going to attack? Clearly, there's only one enemy left. Okay, good. We needed that potion. And then you... Or... Well, we really didn't. I guess we'll just save it. For right now. Ooh, what's this? Huh. Well... I guess we'll fight him then. Because I had nothing better to do today. Take care of him, take care of him. Alright, well I think I'm starting to get the hang of this. Bear with me, as I said before, this is a blind let's play, so... It is going to take me a little while to kind of get, get the hang of it. Mm. And again, it is not really that hard to get the hang of. Alright. Yeah, yeah, I didn't come all this way to look. Bye. Uh. This. I'll buy one of them. And a pea shooter. Oh, I can't afford it. Wow, that cost a lot. Thank My thanks. Do come again. Right, equipment. Bronze blade. Nice. Wait. How much did this thing... Oh, wow. That's a... That's a big difference. Okay. High cap. Reveals enemy HP. That's why we couldn't see it earlier. Okay. Cool, cool. Can I save now, perhaps? My thing do come again. Yep. See you later, man. Well, I'm kind of thinking that this is where I'll end it. Maybe. Manolia Cathedral. Maybe we'll go in here, I guess. What's going on with these people? We pray for the peace of our world. We are ever so devout. <laughs> Well, that's nice. O oh, great Lord and Master, deliver judgment upon the weak and understand and undeserving. Was it the weak and undeserving or the weak and understanding? Why not say a prayer for yourselves? <laughs> well, yeah, why not? You may as well. What did you find? What didn't I find? A hairpin? Hey, this is... Hey, this is Guardia's loyal royal crest. Uh, what? Ah, crap. 
This is not good. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Okay. Cyclone. These two. Alright, tech. Fire whirl. Alright, let's see what this thing does. Ooh, that's cool. That's very cool. I did a lot of damage, too. Not so tough now, are you? I like the combat system. I think it's pretty cool. At least for, like, you know... When did this game come out? I as I said before, I don't know anything about this game, including when it came out. Oh, our level increased again. Phew, wasn't expecting that. Yeah, I don't think anyone was. Who? Heck. Who is this? Lower your guard, and you allow the enemy in. You've come to save the queen. The fiend's lair lies within. It should seem... Will you accompany me? You, you're a demon, and it is a giant. It's a giant talking frog. You, you know I can't stand frogs. I suppose I ought not expect you to trust me, looking as I do. Very well. Do you please uh, do as you please, but I must save the queen. Well, wait. You. You don't seem like a bad frog. I mean, person. I mean, um, what should we do, D-Man? And go with... No, let's go with the frog. What do we got to lose? Right, I guess I'll have to get over my my aversion to slimier, moist-skinned creatures. So what's your name? His name is... You guys knew it was coming eventually. Hang on. Joe Hansen. Yes. Accept. Dang it, I forgot about that. Fine, just Johan then. Johan will suffice. Alright, nice. Nice to meet you, Johan. And you as well. This room is this room must conceal a hidden pa passage. Let us search every corner. Alright, we'll do that in the next episode. Because unfortunately, I think I'm out of time. So, I will see you guys in the next one for part 3 of Chrono Trigger Blind. See you then.